Well, first thing is uh, just identifying who our top 15 guys are on both sides of the ball. Uh, we won't know who. Well, we kind of got an idea of the 11. Uh, can you come out of spring practice that way? But then you got freshmen coming in, and we got a couple of good ones, and probably one that's going to start on the offensive line, which is huge for us. But first, identifying those top 15 guys on both sides of the ball. Really, really installation uh, and special teams right now. Putting a, putting a bigger emphasis, two of them, number two would be special teams, and putting the emphasis on special teams. Because you play special teams 40% of the time. And uh, I just don't think high school coaches put enough into, um, into the special teams where you actually coordinate it, put it together, meet on it, and put emphasis on it. And, you know, a lot of times that can be the determination on whether or not you win a football game, you say it 40% of the time. And the third thing for us, I really think it's just, it's just us being, uh, having camaraderie and finishing what we start. You know, we, this is my freshman class that came in with me, and I, I, it means a lot to put these kids in a great position. And then, of course, people go judging for the first three, four years that you come into a program. We did go to playoffs last year, like I told you earlier. We said, hey, let's get to the playoffs. Now you can't speak that anymore because you've done it. Now you got to speak a little bit further into what you want, and that's region championships and state playoffs, and then, of course, it's the uh, state championship game. So um, those three things I think are really important. And our guys understand it, but they really embrace the process. And uh, right now, it's just one of those things where uh, we're just waiting to put the pads on and see who looks like what.